Muslims have all agreed concerning the sanctioning of judicial, judicial, judicial proceedings is ruling. Judicial proceedings are a communal obligation. The ruling, given the ability to do so, must appoint judges in the land to judge between the people. The Prophet judged between the people and he sent Ali as a judge to Yemen. Uh, the rightly guided caliphs judged between the people and also appointed judges in the different lands. In its merit, said that the Messenger of Allah said, There is no jealousy except with respect to two people. A man whom Allah has given wealth and he uses it up for the sake of the truth. And a man whom Allah has given wisdom and he decides by it and acts accordingly its perils noted that the prophet said whoever has been appointed a judge has truly been slaughtered without a knife reported that the prophet said judges are of three categories one in paradise and two in the hellfire as for the one in paradise it is a man who recognizes the truth and judges it judges in accordance with it as for the man who recognizes the truth but is Unjust in his ruling, he is in the hellfire. And the man who judges among the people with ignorance, he is also in the hellfire. The prohibition of seeking a judgeship, judgeship. The Prophet said to me, O Abdul Rahman, do not ask for the position of authority if you are given it due to your request if you you will be entrusted with it on your own if you are given it without asking for it you will be helped in it when is the role of judge demanded upon a person the companion of wrote in his book i do not know of any difference of opinion among the previous scholars that the one who as the most right to be judged between the Muslims is the one whose virtues, honesty, knowledge and piety are established. A reader of the Book of Allah and knowledgeable of most of its rulings, knowledgeable of the Sunnah and of the Messenger of Allah, Messenger of Allah and memorizing most of it, having similar knowledge of the statements of the companions, knowledgeable of where there is agreement and disagreement, and knowledge of the statements of the jurists among the followers, are able to distinguish what is authentic from what is defective. Follower in your issues, the Book of Allah. If he finds such a solution, there then the sunnah if if there if not there then the he then he acts in accord with what the leading companions acted upon he often goes over points with the people of knowledge and consults with them with politeness and piety he guards his tongue stomach and private parts from what the, from what is forbidden he understands the words of the claimants finally he must be intelligent and staying away staying away from from following desires although we know that no one on the face of the earth combines together all of these attributes it is still a must that the people of every place seek the one who is most complete and virtuous women are not to be judged on the day of the battle of Jamal, Allah benefited me by words that I had heard when it reached the Prophet that the Persians had crowned the daughter of Kisra. Their ruler, he said, a people will not prosper if they are ruled by a woman. A judge is adequate. It is obligatory upon the judge to be between ju just to be, to be just between the two disputants with respect to his look his words his seating arrangements and his entering upon decision wrote uh, judging is truly an unequivocal obligation and a followed practice you must understand if the case comes to you as there is no benefit 
for speaking the truth if it is not implemented, and be equal to the people with respect to your facing them, ever seating in your distance. A normal person should not have. But, mm -hmm. 